During World War II, the U.S. military experimented with an unusual weapon known as the Bat Bomb. This device consisted of a bomb-like container divided into more than a thousand small sections, each holding a Mexican free-tailed bat in hibernation with a tiny incendiary device strapped to it. The plan involved dropping the container from an aircraft with a parachute. As it descended, the container would split open, freeing the bats, which would then seek shelter in roofs and other inaccessible spaces throughout enemy urban areas. A Pennsylvania dentist named Lytle S. Adams, who knew Eleanor Roosevelt, came up with this idea and presented it to the White House roughly one month following Pearl Harbor. The weapon targeted Japanese urban centers, which were especially susceptible to fires because of their predominantly wooden architecture. In 1943, trials using a replica Japanese settlement showed promising results. Nevertheless, the project was abandoned after Fleet Admiral Ernest King determined that the weapon wouldn't be operational until the middle of 1945.